Hi everybody, welcome to Boxing Time. On this channel you will learn a lot of news from the world of boxing. So here we go. Sebastian Fundora could once again challenge for the interim WBC title, though not in a bid to avenge his long career defeat. A ruling was made during the 61st annual WBC convention that would allow Fundora to re-enter the interim title mix. It would come versus Serie Bovachuk in lieu of a previously contracted rematch versus Brian Mendoza against whom he suffered a stunning 7th round knockout defeat this past April to abruptly end his secondary title reign. The WBC had the flexibility to make it possible for the undisputed championship. WBC President Mauricio Suleiman stated prior to issuing the divisional ruling, the WBC had the German Charlo Brian Castano fight and ordered the rematch for the undisputed. At that time, the WBC ordered an interim to keep activity for the boxers to have opportunities. Sebastian Fundora won and defended the title. He lost in a dramatic way to Brian Mendoza and they had a signed contract for a rematch. That rematch did not happen because Mendoza went to Australia to face WBO titleist Tim Tsu. The WBO accepted Serie I Bovacek to fight Sebastian Fundora for the interim title. Jermal Charlo remains the lineal WBC, WBA and IBF champ. He was relieved of his WBO title once he entered the ring for his failed bid to unseat undisputed super middleweight champion Saul Canelo Alvarez on September 30th in Las Vegas. Sue was upgraded from interim to full WBO titleist and defended in a 12-round unanimous decision over Mendoza on October 15th in Broadbeach, Australia. The IBF has since called for Charlo to face its long overdue mandatory challenger Bakram Mertesaliv. A purse bid hearing is scheduled for Tuesday. Charlo will not have to worry about pressure from the WBC, who has made it possible for the two-time champ to move about his career free of restriction. Fundora has not fought since his upset loss to Mendoza on April 8th, a fight in which he won every round until he was dropped hard in round 7 and eventually stopped. The loss ended his interim reign, which began exactly 52 weeks prior in a ninth round stoppage of Erickson Lubin in one of the best fights of 2022. Ukraine's Bovacek has won five in a row since a March 2021 upset eighth round stoppage defeat to Brandon Adams. The Tom Loeffler promoted contender has yet to go the distance through 24 pro bouts. The loss to Adams marked the only time he was extended beyond the sixth round in his boxing lifetime. A date was not set for the approved and ordered interim title fight. However, the winner could be met with a mandatory challenger of their own. Subscribe. Please like and comment. This is very important for the development of the channel. See you later.